Good day friends, Maloa here and today we will be looking at the new character creation on Bullroar as well as looking at the new introduction zone for the Swan Fleet area. Let's go! Okay, now the most important thing to realize is that they've added this new button up here. It's not fair, I didn't jump at me the first time. Um, but this is what it will allow you to change it. So if I change tutorial here, you can see I have three options. The Shadow of Angmar, um, this is the traditional area for hobbits to start. There's before the shadow. This will allow you to start in the new zone in Swan Fleet. And what's really nice about this is that it'll allow you all races to have the same beginning. So say you and a friend are starting at the same time, you want to have a hobbit, they want to have an elf. If all both of you select before the shadow, you will be in the same zone. The third option is just to skip the tutorial completely. If you have multiple tunes and you just don't want to do the tutorial again, you can skip it. So, But we're going to play it. We're going to select here before the shadow. Okay, and I'm going to close it and you can see it updated there called Before the Shadow. Um, I hope that they make it more obvious, that button, um, or work it into the flow of the setup. Um, I think it would have been better if they had create a character and then once they click that brought up a screen that allowed you to swap it, but they don't have it, they just have it set up here. So. Um, Let's create this character and then we're going to hop in and play this new zone. You can see from the road dust on your clothes that you have traveled a great distance to be here. And so as lo so long as you cause no trouble for my folk, you're welcome to stay. It takes a hearty sort of make a living here on the edge of the wild and the folk of Moss Ward will gladly put you to work if you're willing. I think you'll find the people here to be friendly and welcoming if you treat them kindly. Talk to Gerald by the fountain in the town square. I see Gerald is out and about. Why not introduce yourself to him? I hope you don't mind me staring. We don't see many adventurers in these parts. The nearest we usually get is that Menelder. Says he's a ranger, but it seems to me that just an excuse for having dirt on his clothes and disappearing into the wild at all hours. But anyway, Moss Ward is a quiet village, always has been. Cause no trouble and you can stay as you like. But first things first, you should pay a visit to our blacksmith, Scardy Benblade. He'll clean and fix up your gear for you. The shop is just up those steps. Look for his sign and the anvil on it. The blacksmith shop is right there, up those steps. Huh? Who's this? You're an adventurer, I can tell. What brings you to Mossward? Before you can answer, the dwarf goes right on talking. This is a quiet village, and the folk here like it that way. I assume Bevan warned you not to disturb the peas. Of course he did. He says that to me near every fortnight, as if I might summon a troop of rowdy dwarves from my homeland at any moment. Wah ha ha If only I could. What did you say your name was? We don't see many adventurers in Mossward. I suppose Meneldir counts. I am no adventurer, Scotty. Well, what are you then? I was a ranger. It is quite different. Bah! You won't find a better smithy for miles around, friend. Put your gear on the counter, and I'll fix it up for you. Very good. Won't cost you anything, friend. Not this time, anyway. Is
Here you go. It's important to have a fine weapon. Just carrying around a bunch of equipment won't help you much in battle. As I'm sure you know, you want to be sure to equip your weapons before you get into a fight. My friend Scardi speaks the truth. You do not want to stride into battle without your weapons equipped, for they will do you little good at the bottom of your bags. He is right on this point as well. Mossward is a quiet village, and few adventurers come this way, let alone one who carries herself as you do. What road has brought you to Mossward, on the border of Swanfleet, my friend? You share some of the features of the folk who live in the Stour Vales nearby, but I deem you come not from their village. You consider what should be said of your past in the to this curious stranger. Would you speak of your most unhoppet like desire to see distant lands and wanders beyond the borders of the Shire, or of the dangers that even now encroach upon the lands of all free folk? compelling you to fight on behalf of those who cannot. Before you can choose the right words, Medaldur raises his palm. I do not mean to pry. Your past is your own. My chieftain Strider always said... What is that? The town bells! Something is amiss outside! Follow me. Hurry! The town is afire! We are under attack! Under attack? By whom? This smells like orcs to me, Maloa. But I cannot understand it. Orcs have not troubled these lands for many years. Come with me and stay close. We will get to the bottom of this and save the town if we must. Follow me. Look there! we found the villain! Show him no mercy! That's the way! Well done, my friend! This goblin could not have set so many fires alone! There is trouble to the east, Meneldir! I need fighters! My new friend here is capable, and will provide the help you need. But what will you do, Manel dear? I will circle around and search for the one who leads these goblins. Farewell for now. Rangers! Follow me, my new friend. There will be fighting. The bells stopped. Are we safe? I would not count on it. What did I tell you? I see you met our new visitor. I like this one much more than these others. Me too, Scardi. Come with us. Look ahead! Those are not goblins. Uruks! Kegwin! I'm not afraid, Mother. Not afraid? <laughs> this rat hasn't heard of the fighting Urukai, boys! The machinery of war has been set in motion! 
The time of the orc is at hand! Mosswood, attack! Kill them all! Are you all right, son? If I had a better sword, I could have slain him myself! I wasn't afraid! Oh, Tegwin. Thank you so much for saving our son from those horrible creatures. What were they? Some breed of orc? Why would they come to Mossward? We are most fortunate you were here, stranger. What do you make of this? These Uruks have decorated their equipment with the sigil. I have not seen the mark before. The mark of a white hand. It may be the symbol of a raiding party, but for all the hurt this band has inflicted upon Mossward, they were still few in number and disorganized. What need have they for such a sigil? None now, thanks to our efforts, but I still I wonder. I will think on it, Maloa. What meaning might this mark possess, Maloa? Will you ask Ellery if she has seen the symbol before? The white hand? No, I have not seen the symbol before, and that troubles me. What new danger might it signify? For now, we should help the folk of Mossward recover from this attack. I trust you will lend your aid. You have become embroiled in this, just as I have. If it is the life of adventure you seek, I assure you that you seem to have found it, or it has found you. You have become part of a larger world, Maloa, and it may prove different than the one in which you lived until now. Dangers must be faced and threats opposed and overcome if you are willing to strive against them. Not everyone is, but I judge that you will be no stranger to triumph and victory. Okay, I should be out of the instance now, and this is what the map of Moss Word looks like, and then this is in Swan Fleet, and we're down here. So this is the new starting area, this little village over here. Okay, here's a new quest. This is a little extra never hurts. This is the new quest that you need to do that'll give you the trait for the writing characteristics. So this is another big change that they're making in terms of when you are able to get a steed. Now the steed isn't the fastest, but it is reasonable. So you just gotta pick it up, finish it. You pick it up from Scar to the blacksmith. And now you can see I've got the skill acquired. I now open up my mounts. You can see I have a little steed. Um, let's go outside and look. Take a look at what this looks like. Rather cute and nondescript. Greetings. Okay, I have completed level two. And now you can see I've got, this has opened up. Um, my treats panel has finally opened up. So this is very different from before. So I can start trading now at least one point. Okay. That's all I wanted to do and show you guys. Um, this area looks like it's gonna be a lot of fun. It does look a little bit more complex than what Arch it was, um, but it's probably just because it's unfamiliar. This show is possible because of your support and encouragement. Become a patron and get access to more amazing content and see your name here in the credits. Thanks for watching.